Hey guys, Skull here, and today we are back playing some more Mod Sauce 2 for episode 4, I think. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's episode 4. Um, you guys may notice a big difference for those of you who've already seen my previous videos. I am now on a YouTuber server, and to the guys that was on the public server, well, that are on the public server, it's no hard feelings. I mean, I'm still going to come on to the server, but um, I'm just not going to record on there. To be fair, I was a plan I was planning on coming to this server first because this server is like a youtuber you had to apply for it whatever um and yeah long story short I got invited to the server so here's what happened okay you you guys may know some different stuff um while I was resource gathering you guys may see a waypoint right there I got ate by a hungry node I, I was just w running through a cave and I feel my character pull kind of like this. And I thought it was something wrong with my keyboard. I hit the key. And it just whoosh. And it's like sucked me up and killed me. And I've done it a few times. So I remade my tools. Um, I remade my pick. I remade my diamond sword. My lumber axe. My shovel. And my hammer. And mo some of these weren't still. These are still now. This was already still. And I just found my iron side. I didn't know I had it in my chest. <clears throat> But, um, this episode, I want to get into Batania. Batania is a really, really cool mod. Oh, whoa, that was a little bit of a frame rate stutter. But, um, it's a really cool mod. So, what we're going to need to do first, we're going to need to make a Petal Apothecary. Petal Apothecary. Come on, any eye, there you go. Oh, you can make different colors now? That must have got recently added. That's pretty cool. I like that. Um, okay. So, this is very cheap. We're just going to grab a stack of cobble. Uh, we're going to make some slabs. Boom. And I already went to the mining world and got um, some stuff. And also, I'm not exactly to where I'm at, which I mean, it's perfectly fine because we were just going from back and forth to the server. Um, the owner, I've got gaming with, I, I, don't, I don't know how you say his name, is Sh Sheridan. Uh, I think that's how you say it. Um, here, let's go ahead and sleep real quick. Um, but yeah, so he, he let me get the most of where I'm at. I mean, I don't have the exact amount of items that I had before, which, I mean, that's perfectly fine, because uh, we, we just got tired of going back and forth from that from the server. So, yeah, um, we're going to need to make a bucket, which we've only got two iron in this chest. Also, I reset up my mechanism. Um, I'm no longer using the RFX cider. I just have a cable running into a blue energy cell, um, like, right there, like that. That block right there from the cable, that grass block, it's right under there. And then it gets downgraded to the red cable, as you guys can see right there. So, let's go ahead and do this like so. Also, um, here's a miniature channel update. You guys have probably been already been noticing I've been slacking a little bit on my videos. It's just because I've been super busy, like, within this past week. And also, school starts Monday. I'm recording this video on a Saturday, so this video should go out tomorrow, which is... Today should be a Sunday for you guys. Uh, that sounded a little bit confusing, but, um, yeah, whoa, what's the deal with my FPS in this forest? Um, okay, whatever. Let's, hmm, should I make it inside of my base or no? I don't know, let's no, let's not, no, that'd be a bad idea. Alright, so, oh yeah, I got two mystical white pellets, okay, cool. So, let's go ahead and go over here, let's do it like somewhere near my farm because it's where all my seeds and stuff are um i replaced the soil with potatoes so i don't know if hemp seeds work they might they might not let's go ahead and get an infinite source of water going i don't know why i pulled from that let's just do that and let's go ahead and get another and also mobs are a big thing here and also this is a european server well it's located you know europe whatever eu whatever um, so I might get a little bit of lag, as you guys can see. This guy is just minding his own business. And every time I go into the nether, I lag like crazy. It's not the server, it's actually, it's just because, why are you not attacking me? Uh, this guy had a hemp seed. Oh, no, we had camellia, whatever, seeds. Alright, so let's go ahead and get this guy. Okay. Just do that. Oh. Boom. Okay. So now all we have to do is just place the, this bucket here. 
boom, infinite source of water, basic Minecraft knowledge here. So we're going to need to make a pure daisy. I almost forgot the name of it. Um, this guy is really easy to make. It is just four mystical white petals, and we just throw a seed in there. So let's go ahead and one, two, boom, boom, and then let's just drop this guy in here. Now I'm curious, did, it, did that go in there? What? Where'd it go? Um. Okay, yes, yeah, in there. It just didn't render in. So now I'm gonna have to break that again because that did that. Give me my petals. There we go. Let's go ahead and grab these guys. All right, whatever. Um, I'm curious to see if the hemp seeds work. Does, does do these work? No, they don't. Um, what about regular hemp seeds? I need. Okay, so apparently I need to go ahead and plant wheat down again. I, I've got. I got. I've got wheat seeds. Um, so let me go ahead and grab those guys real quick, and I will be right back. Okay, so let's go ahead and replace some of the potatoes with wheat seeds, and let's go ahead and do this like so. Boom, 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 and boom. Now the reason why I left potatoes here is because they're they're just really good on saturation when it comes to baking them. So yeah, let's go ahead and do that. And uh, why you know work? Okay, so let's go ahead and just do this like so. All right, four of them is in there, and now all I have to do is just this, and boom. All right, there we go. So now we have a pure daisy, and all we have to do is just throw this guy down right here. Oh, didn't mean to break that. Throw that guy down right there. Let's go ahead and grab these seeds over here because why not? And we're going to need to put stone around this guy. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And you can stack these up by making the floating flower. And yeah. So what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to cut away a little bit. I'm going to wait till this guy turns into living rock, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to get a starter mana gen. So what we're going to need is yellow petals, orange petals, and light blue. And the mining world is a great source for fl getting flowers. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get some of these guys. Um, we're going to need light blue, orange, and yellow. And I've already got a waypoint to the portal, so I'm not going to get lost. And if I do, um, I've got some serious problems. So yeah, I will be right back. And also, I'm going to make living wood. You do the same thing with Living Rock, except for you just put logs around the Pure Daisy. So yeah, BRBs! Okay, so I am currently making Living Wood. Let's go ahead and make a crafting station for right here. So what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to make some day blooms. Like I said, yellow petal, orange petal, light blue. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. So let's go ahead and get a few of those guys going, and let's make our mana pool. And this guy is just the regular mana pool that can only make the other mana pools, so I really don't care what it looks like, so I'm just going to throw him right here. And let's make a few more day blooms, like so, boom, 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 and boom. Oh, there you go, and as you guys can see, the living wood just turned, which is pretty cool. We're also going to need to make a wand of the forest here in a second. Okay, that should be enough. Keep in mind, these guys only do work in the daytime. And we're also going to need to make a mana spreader as well. Do not place these guys side by side. You will get diminishing returns. You're going to want to place them in a grid-like pattern. Like so, and let me make one more just so my OCD does not drive me insane. Like so, boom, 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 boom. If I say like so one more time, I know there's that one guy in the comments. Okay, so as you guys can see, everything's all lit up, cool. And we're also going to need to make a wand of the forest, which is living wood twigs, which is just living wood. So let's go ahead and chop these guys up. There we go. And let's make three living wood twigs. 
Boom, boom, boom. Let's actually use the white petals. All right, there we go. Nice. So what we can, what this allows us to do is see our mana status here. This guy has hardly any mana, and we also have no mana spreader, so there's nothing going to go in here. So let's go ahead and get more living wood going, and I will be right back. Okay, so the living wood just turned. So like I said, we're going to want to make a mana spreader, which is this guy right here. So let's go ahead and put two living wood here because it's pretty much all we have right now. Let's go ahead and chop these guys up. Now, I want to go ahead and get into some overpower overpowered mana generation as well. So, we're going to want to make hydrangeas. As you guys can prob probably already notice, it's already in my inventory. The um, stuff to make it is, anyway. Because we need mana to make it. So, let's go ahead and shift-click this guy in here. And these guys should... Oh, uh, hey, zombie. How... You want to be in the video? You're, you were in the video. Good, good job. So, we want to shift-click these guys to the mana spreader. And these guys start generating mana straight from the sun, which is pretty cool. Uh, okay, boom and boom. <clears throat> so these guys are going to start generating some mana. And we're also going to want to get some more stuff here. Boom, boom, boom. I'm probably going to install Optifine. Because I, I, I'm, fine, I'm perfectly fine when I'm not recording. I get like, I don't know, 250 FPS when I'm not recording in this forest. Um, I am using the X264 codec, which is very heavy on my processor. Well, I wouldn't say very heavy, but it's pretty heavy on the processor because it compresses my videos, like, a lot. So the file sizes are much smaller. So I'll probably have to get Optifine or something to make my frame rate a little bit better when recording. I know you guys can see, like, a miniature stutter here and there. But, um, this guy should have a little bit of mana. We really don't need much to make a regular mana pool. Let's see. Yeah, we, we hardly need, like, any at all. So, um, I guess we're going to wait on this guy. Okay, so, um, it just turned. Let's go ahead and grab these guys. And let's make another mana pool. And wha-bam. There we go. So, all we have to do is just throw this guy in here. We have enough mana. Perfect. Um, let's go ahead and break this guy because we're never going to need him again. Um, I mean, I guess we'll keep him here for future reference. I'm too lazy to make a chest. So, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to... Okay, there we go. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to let it generate a little bit of mana because I want to make some hydrangeas. And this guy requires some mystical mana petal. Wait, yeah, blue mana petals, which they don't really require much. But I do kind of want to make these guys in like a heap of a few of them. And also, I'm going to need to get some floating flowers, which I'm going to need dirt and pasture seeds, which require shared grass. So, and I'm getting shot by a skeleton. So, yeah, guys, I, I know I cut away like a billion times already, but, um, BRBs. Okay, so I want, this is actually taking forever, so I want to make, go ahead and make a few hydrangeas. Like, so, um, we need... I want to make four of them, so we're going to need four blue mana petals. One, two, three, four. Oh, that one didn't turn. There we go. And we're going to need four light, well, four cyan. Like so. Oh, wow, so hard to do it with the mana spreader right there. Okay, so we can only make three. Um, that's fine. So let's go ahead and get this guy made. Um, we're going to need... Blue, pink, and cyan. So let's go ahead and get this guy ready. Blue. Let's get this guy. And let's get this guy. Okay. Um, so I do want to make an infinite water source for the hydrangea. So we're going to go ahead and get that set up real quick after this. Three. And I think we need two cyan. And then one regular. And then just a seed, I think. Oh, no. So, blue mana petal. Oh, that's light blue mana petal. That's not cyan. Oh, wow. GG's. G to the G's. Okay, um. Let's go ahead and make a few of these then. 
And let's just pretend that didn't happen, because it didn't. Oh, do we have enough to make four? Oh, we do. Nice. Okay. So let's go ahead and get some of these guys and some of these guys. Okay. And we're going to throw those down and pretend that didn't happen. We're going to go ahead and get our inventory organized. Like so. And then we have a cyan mana petal. That guy was still in there, so I'm going to break that guy. I know I'm darping really hard, guys. Sorry. Um, so we need cyan, blue, two more cyan, a pink, that, and boom. There we go. Uh, I kind of got scared for a second. I thought it didn't work. I'm like, oh, no, no, not again, not again. So let's go ahead and make a few more of these. There we go, and we're going we're gonna make two more. Alright, so one more. Boom boom. Boom 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 boom. And boom. Okay, so now we need to make an infinite water source so that this guy can pull from. So let's go ahead and get our glass, and then let's go ahead and get this guy built. Let's go ahead and just move this, make this guy the center, and we're probably going to need to make more mana spreaders, which that's perfectly fine. I'll just do that off camera, and let's go ahead and get some torches placed down, and let's go ahead and get our water sources in. Boom. Boom. All right. Infinite water source, cool. So all we have to do is just place the hydrangeas down. Boom, 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 and boom. So that should be fine. Let's go ahead and grab... Oh, no, don't do that. Do not do that. Let's go ahead and grab this guy. And let's just go ahead and put him right up here. And now let's get our wand of the force and let's go ahead and start binding these guys. Boom. And we'll go ahead and bind these guys to these. Oh, why are you not working? Should right click. Oh, you're supposed to go to a mana spreader. Okay. Let's go ahead and get these guys all bound. And I know these guys aren't working right now because it's dark, but that's fine. Actually, you know what? No, let's go ahead and break these. We don't need these. And let's go ahead and get these guys all spread. And there's a zombie. So what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to let this guy build out some more mana, make some more hydrangeas, and we will be right back. Okay, so a little bit later, I have got the stuff to make some floating hydrangeas. So let's go ahead and do this. Um, now, it's, it's a few hours later. So basically, what this is, is just infinite water source, and it's just towered up a little bit. It's just like it was before, just a little bit higher. And um, so basically, what these guys do, just suck up water from the infinite water source, and the water gets replaced, and then it sucks up the water again. And there's a creeper there. Um, it'd be pretty nice if you didn't blow up beside this, because that'd be a mess. Here, come over here, creeper. Come here. Come here. Come here. Don't blow up there. Mob griefing is turned on. Okay, there we go. All right. So basically, what this guy does, it all of these produce mana from the water. So are these guys bound to the mana spreader? They are. These guys are good. And these guys are good. Also, I placed a chunk loader here. Like I said, it has been a few hours. I didn't AFK here. I just placed a chunk loader here. And how's this guy doing? Is he overflowing on mana? No, he's good. Let's go ahead and check up on this guy. And this, this is actually getting mana really, really fast. Let's go ahead and make some more pasture seeds here. 
And basically, guys, I know this has probably been a short video, but it's pretty much been all day for me. Um, so if you guys enjoyed the video, also, I'm going to be upgrading this guy off camera. So, and like I said, this thing is chunk loaded, so this thing will fill up over time. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, please be sure to hit like, and I will see you guys next time.